Hi Pisces, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your reading for January. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Whatever comes up, comes up. This reading may or may not be for you. For Pisces, what does Pisces have to expect for January? Now, this could be at any time in January. These cards don't, look at this, they're just a dropping like flies. Dropping like flies. Somebody is uh, going backwards. They're going backwards or they're stuck. There could be some mental exhaustion here and you need to take a break. Maybe you're in the process or you need to, you just need to take a time out, it looks like. You could be dealing with another woman who, or a woman, it doesn't have to be another woman or can be another woman if you're a woman watching this. If you're the Pisces male, you could be dealing with a very bitter individual. This woman is not happy and she has a weapon in her hand and she uses her mouth as a weapon as well. So you could be dealing with somebody who is very upset and, you know, it could, it, there could be some uh, harsh words that are said. I just got to be honest with you here. Um, or this could be, if you're the Pisces woman, you could be in this state of mind where, you know, you, you're not happy. It's an unhappy woman, okay? She's not happy and she's got a weapon in her hand. So, and she's pissed. She's pissed. So she's pissed about something. Hmm. Mm. <laughs> now we have we have uh, a sacrifice here. It's like she's pissed. It has to do with wish fulfillment. She's pissed. She's pissed about. She thought that she was going to get that other cup, you know, that ten of cups. She thought. She thought she, she had it all. But it looks like there's been a wedge. There's been a wedge put in the wheel, you know, that, that has stopped it. Has stopped the, something has stopped the wish, wish fulfillment. And she's probably pissed, whoever this woman is, that, you know, she sacrificed her time and energy... And you may be at a point where you see things completely different, differently. You're seeing things completely differently. Yeah, she's mad because she didn't get victory and success. She's mad because she didn't get that. She didn't get that ten of cups that she thought she was gonna get. So. This is either the woman that you're dealing with. If you're the Pisces male, it could be you. It could be you if you were the Pisces female. You know, you're, it's like I didn't make progress that I thought I was going to make. Even though this started out as extremely happy. You know, it started out as really, really abundant. And now this person may have stood up and walked away. And I'm, I'm pissed, so I'm not sure. Mm, somebody from the past. There's memories of the past. There's memories here. Somebody from the past is involved in your reading. Of course there is. Um, these memories are holding you back. Keeping you stuck. Now, the thing is, it looks like you've broken free from something. You have. You have. But somebody's pissed because of it. Ooh, ye. remember I was talking about this. So it looks as though she didn't get the, somebody didn't get their Ten of Cups that they were promised. And if you want to, you, you know, you go ahead, go ahead. Don't, you know, don't keep your promise. <laughs> Not a big wise decision to piss off this woman in this, in this reading because, you know, 
she didn't. She thought she was going to get that ten of cups. She thought she was going to get her extreme happiness. It's funny. I brought it up. It comes up right underneath it. These are very significant together. They're mirroring each other. So, you know, I thought I was going to get my wish fulfillment. I was lied to. And I've sacrificed my time for no reason. And now, now you know, you want to be free? You know, you want to be free-spirited? You want to... head in a new direction now I feel like you guys may be if you see what's what's mirroring you always gotta see what's mirroring each other a lot of readers don't don't catch this some do some don't it looks like there's somebody has had a change of heart somebody has had a change of heart with somebody from their past and they may want to communicate you know they may want to come in and communicate with this person from the past but this woman is pissed She's pissed, really pissed. And, you know, maybe if you are the Pisces female, you could have somebody that wants to communicate with you, wants to come back. Somebody wants to come back with it. You want to go back to them or they want to come back to you. You know, if you are the Pisces female, you're probably like, no. Mm -mm. Same with the Pisces male, but I mean, I don't know. There's, or I'm not sure how this is going, but it's like somebody from the past is very significant here. Somebody is finding the courage to, you know, I, I want to work with you now. I want to work together. I want to, I, I want to put in the work. I don't want, I'm not stuck anymore. But I think there's been a, some sort of, uh, somebody took a break. They took a break from a relationship to be free, you know, to be free spirited and play the field. You know, somebody took a break and now they want to go back and I'll tell you what. Good luck. Good luck. Matter than hell. You know? And somebody could get hurt. If you gotta, you gotta always, like I said, you always gotta see what's mirroring each other. It's like, look at the swords. That's, that's like, you, you know? Somebody's probably gonna get hurt. It's a battle. You know, so I feel as though... Somebody is finding the courage to communicate ready to work together they're no longer stuck in their head they're see they've been enlightened they've come to some sort of clarification you know they've come to some sort of realization that my wish fulfillment was with this woman and you know i let go of something good and now I, you know i would like to go back i want to go back but you can't go back because she's so pissed somebody wants to go back to this pissed off woman or this pissed off woman is you. Um, somebody's somebody's charging in. Somebody is charging in really, really fast, wanting to communicate, wanting to work together, wanting to put in effort, wanting to you know do whatever it takes to get your approval. You know, it's like. I've learned new things. See what I can do. You know, I'm willing to do whatever. I'm willing to do whatever it takes to get the happiness back that I've lost after this person has taken a break. They've taken a break. You know, they needed time, needed time to do whatever. They were stuck for quite some time and, and they've thrown away. They've thrown away some sort of happiness. They have. And it looks like now they, they can't move forward. They can't move forward. From this person from the past. This is somebody from the past. It is. Oh, goodness gracious. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. This is the Empress. Okay, the Empress is uh, the pick of the litter. And whoever this person is that was stuck knows that they are dealing with the Empress. They know. They know who they're dealing with. This is the pick. This is the Earth Mother. This is the, the one. This is the one that um, is loyal. She's beautiful. 
she's kind, she's generous, she's nurturing, she's uh, got many options. And whoever this person is that wants to come charging in to after this woman knows it. They know, they know who this woman is and they want her. I mean, she's creative. She's glowing. She's got all kinds of admirers. And perhaps, you know, they were being unrealistic. Whoever the person is that wants to come back realizes that they're not satisfied now. They're not satisfied. They're, they were being, being unrealistic and they're not satisfied that this woman... is no longer invested in them. You know, it's like when you give up, when you give up on the past, that's when, when you finally give up, when you finally grown, when you've dealt with the pain. This empress has dealt with her pain. She has. She's delivered the pain. She's no longer in pain. She's healed. She's healed. And she's beautiful. She is the pick. She is Taurus. Okay. Uh, she's the pick. Could be you, Pisces, woman. This is not a man. This is not a man. This is a, the woman watching this reading. Whether it's the cross watcher or the Pisces woman, it is the woman that is watching this reading at this time. Or it is the woman that you Pisces males have your eye on. This woman, she doesn't chase men. She doesn't chase, chase opportunities. She's very trustworthy and loyal. She doesn't play games and she doesn't settle. Somebody sees this. She knows her worth. Therefore, the rest of the world knows her worth. That's the vibration she puts out. I know what I am worth. I will not settle. I will not play games. And when she sets out that vibration, everybody sees it. She's absolutely glowing. She is the, she's drop dead gorgeous. That's what she is. From the inside and the outside because that's what she puts out. And everybody can see it. So, and now we have somebody from the past that is wanting to go back because they can't, they can't move forward. They can't move forward. But this woman, you know, she's, she's not happy. She's definitely not happy. She's not happy with the past anymore. It's like, I, I don't come near me. She ain't going to, don't come near me. Oh, jeez. Um, yeah, she's walked away completely. She doesn't want to have anything do, to do. This woman doesn't want to have anything to do with something that is unrealistic. Something that she can't take to the bank. She can't. If she can't take it to the bank, if she can't bank on it, if there's never going to be any growth, then I don't want it. I don't want it. So I feel like you guys are walking away from something. Uh, uh, I think you have somebody, if you are the, especially the Pisces woman, if you are the Pisces woman, you have a man that is coming in from your past that wants you to, wants you to go back, wants you to take them back. But you're like, nope, uh-uh, not interested. Not interested whatsoever. If you are the Pisces man and you are still and you're in love with somebody from your past, tough shit. Doesn't look good. Yep, there's no confidence in this. There's no confidence. There's there's no growth. There's a, no need. There's no need to hang on. There's there's a there's a there's a I've already let go because the, the strength upright is somebody who has let go. I've already let go. I don't have any faith in this. I don't have any desire. I just, I'm not invested. No, 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 no. I have no vision of a future with you. The, there's no vision. There isn't. There isn't. So I feel like all communication will be halted. It'll be stopped. It'll be stopped. I think there is somebody that is going, or maybe it's been blocked already. I don't know. Uh, but it looks as though, you know, there's going to be communication that comes in. 
from somebody that probably ghosted you or you ghosted them. It can go both ways. Somebody that really brought you down your self-worth. They brought down your self-esteem and they brought you backwards and this person is now communicating. They want to they wanna move forward. They do and you're like, nope, no. And this is for the woman. The woman is, is saying no here. It is. The woman is saying no. She's going to put a halt to it. The woman is going to put a halt. Nope. Not interested. Um, <laughs> you never know where I'm going to put these cards. The five of swords is, oh my God, it rubbed my heart at this point. Whew. So yeah. It's like, no, I just want to be happy. I, I just want to be happy. I don't want to be, I don't want to be involved in the power struggles. I don't want to be involved in the conflicts. And somebody is, is being told no. That's what I see. So I feel like you're going to receive some communication from somebody or you're going to communicate with somebody from your past and the answer is going to be no. Especially and it, for the woman, for the woman watching this, it's the woman making the call. She is the power horse here. She is. The woman is in charge. And I think that's where the problem lies. Is that the man wanted to be in charge. He had to bring her down in, in the past. And he did bring her down. She found her strength. She found her strength and she healed and she walked and she walked away. And I don't look like she's going back because she's so pissed, okay? She's she's not a happy camper. And she's like, no way, no way. That'll take away all the healing that I've done. If you go back to this person, all the well, all the healing that you have done will bring you backwards. It, you'll go backwards. You'll go backwards if you go it you will. You will. And it's a woman. It's a woman. There's a woman here that will end up going. She's not going to do it anyway. This woman's not going to do it. She's not. She's not. She's too wise. She's too wise. Whoever the woman is watching this reading is like. <laughs> so that's what I got to say about that. It's over. It's done. I'm not interested. <laughs> it's dead. The love has died. It's over. So I feel like there is a, it's an ending. We have an ending here because of what we have a woman in this dynamic that knows her worth. I feel like there's somebody that took a break that needed to take a break to find themselves, to become enlightened, you know. They needed to, they needed to think about things. They needed to figure out where they wanted to go in life, you know. They needed to, uh, they had some sort of karma they had to deal with, whatever the excuse is, you know. I had to do this. I had to do that, you know whatever and now they want to come back and, and this person has dealt with the pain they have they've dealt with the pain I'm good I've moved on I'm no longer invested in you I found my wish fulfillment this person sees this woman's worth now all of a sudden it's like damn I made a mistake um you know I shouldn't have let her get away I did let her get away I want her back and it's t a little bit too late it's a little bit too late. So I feel as though we have a woman here in this reading that is about to um, end something once and for all. And there could be a verbal, you know, altercation with that Queen of Swords reversed, you know. And it could be, it could be uh, not so pretty, okay? Could be. It looks as though there's there's no renewal here no no this it, you know the thing is is that somebody was stuck in their head for too long stuck in their own prison when they could have they could have walked out of it a long time ago but they didn't they couldn't find the mental straight strength to make a move Therefore, the other person that is walking away felt betrayed and at a complete loss. And they had no choice but to find their strength to heal. And I don't want to go back there. I don't want to go back there and undo all the work that I have done. 
So now we have this this new opportunity. This 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 new uh, this could be self love. The end of love. Because this is the end of love. But this ending brings about a new beginning. Now, I don't know if this is a reconciliation or what. Somebody's offering their heart. Somebody is offering their love after it ended. It's That is the truth. Somebody is is offering their, lo their love after something ended. There could have been another person involved. That just came to me. It could have been a Leo. I don't know. And now they have regrets and they want to go back to their past and rekindle the love that's that ended. Hmm. But doesn't look like... Doesn't look like... I want to be on this roller coaster ride. <laughs> Doesn't look like I can play this game anymore. I feel like there's been too much imbalance. And now this person has done a lot of healing. And the other person, I'm not sure. There's a lack of healing right here. So we got one person in this dynamic that won't, that can't move on. That can't move on from something. They can't evolve the hell is this mentally trapped on that emotional roller coaster we got this extreme up and downs here extremes and this person is going to be like no are you on drugs because this can be like some sort of addiction addictions have gotten in the way what kind of drugs are you on today Whew. We have somebody here that is wanting wanting a new beginning. And they've been trying to manifest it. And they have been trying to shed their old ways. And they've been using all their resources to make changes. But I think that they have been, they've, they've made some really good attempts. But they've also been hindering their progress. We have the six of wands underneath here reverse it's way under they've been hindering their progress with some sort of addictions you know trying to escape reality escape something the magician is takes action so we have somebody here that is about to take some action they are finding the strength that they didn't have they're finding the courage you know they're finding oh, their ability, they're seeing things clearly about what they lost by the looks of things. And I feel as though we have somebody here that is about to communicate how they truly feel. You know, they are. And it's about, it's, it is somebody from the past. It absolutely is. So, you know, somebody is going to communicate. Because this is communication. This is communication with the past. All right. Somebody from the past is going to, you know, be a very prominent player in the month of January. Put it that way. And there's an opportunity for a reconciliation here. Somebody wants a reconciliation. I mean, the Ace of Cups is a reconciliation. It is. But it's like, ah. Uh, you know, this, there's been too many extremes. There's been been too many ups and downs. And this woman, she's like, <laughs> I got so many options. I don't have time to play with somebody who's mentally trapped in their own prison. I don't. She's an older woman. This The Empress is an older woman. She is somebody 40 and above. She's not no spring chicken. She's beautiful. She's, she's beautiful from life experience. She don't got time to waste on somebody who can't get out of their head. Who wants to play games? You know? Uh-uh. No. No, I'm not, you know, I'm not going to sit around and wait because, you know, tick, 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 tick. Time's a ticking. The clock's ticking. And I feel like she sees this as being completely over. It's completely over. There's an ending here. You know, and it's like, if I go back, all it's going to do is cause a huge 
imbalance in my life. So yeah, we have somebody here who is finding their inner resources to communicate about their true feelings, but is it too late? Oh God, is it too late? 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 Please give me the answer. Please give me the answer. Oh, there's a lack of closure. There's a lack of closure. It's like, it's not over yet. It's not over yet. The connection you had with somebody with from the past is not over yet. And I can't pretend because if it was upright, I could say it's over. It's not over yet. <laughs> there's a lack of closure. Closure is still needed. Whether you give it one more shot, this is a one and this is a one, or not, is it too late? Conflict, conflicted, conflicted, very conflicted. You know, it's like, this might be more than I, you know, more than I can chew. I don't want to bite off more than I can chew. Whoever you're dealing with here is probably going to be very upset over what happened okay there's a there's a very really seriously okay there's definitely an upset here um and there's going to be difficult communication between the two people because of what happened in the past there is there is and i think whoever you know this person may need some time time to go within time to think about this time to reflect she whoever this woman is is probably going to be presented with an opportunity to reconnect and start have another chance with somebody from their past and it's just and it's the woman here so if you are the Pisces male it's you making the offer it's this is a woman this ain't no man okay so this and that's it's right up here this is this is the main focus okay so this woman that is watching this reading is probably going to need some time to think about this, to go within. And she may want to withdraw for a minute. You know, and you're going to need to give her time to think because she's probably going to be like, you know, i got to think about this. i got to listen to my intuition. And she will follow her intuition. Her intu intuition will lead the way. But you see the key. This woman is very, she's highly intuitive. She's, she is definitely highly intuitive. She is, she's the high priestess. Could be a, I, these both represent Taurus. So I don't know if you're dealing with a Taurus. We have Sagittarius, we have Leo, we have Gemini, we have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Uh, we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. And that's who I see so far. But anyway, we have a very highly intuitive individual here who is probably going to need to retreat for a minute when she gets this offer to really use her intuition and go within and figure out what her next, you know, what she should do, what she should do. So really listen to your intuition during this time. Take all the time that you need to reflect and meditate on this and you know, get the answer that is going to be best for you in regards to this situation that hasn't ended yet. It has not had the closure, the appropriate closure. It has not. It has not. And I think there's going to be some sort of communication that comes in that causes a mental conflict for, for you know, this woman even. She's going to be conflicted because, you know, this person had the key to her heart. Oh, bastard. Anyhow, um, but my question was, is it too late? Well, there hasn't been any closure yet. This person now wants to work together, and it's just like, follow your intuition. That's my answer. Follow your intuition. Let your intu intuition lead the way. Take all the time that you need, okay, to ma when making your decision, because there's, you know, will it be successful? Will it be, if, if this woman took this person back, would it be successful? Would it be successful? Oh.
Ah, ha, ha. There'd be, I don't, it doesn't look good. It doesn't look like it would work out. It doesn't look like there'd be, I think, I think the flame has been put out. I do. I think the fire is gone. There's no more attraction and there isn't. So I, I totally agree with that. I do. I, I believe that there's no stability here. There's been, there's no stability. There's, there's nothing to build on, okay? I can't, it's, it's like an opportunity that I can't never bank on because it's always slipping away. It's always slipping out of my hands. It's always slipping away. And I mean, that's what Pisces is, right? It's a slippery fish. And this is slipping. It's going down. And no offense to you guys watching this, but there's no there's no growth here there's no there's no ability for growth now if you are the pisces you could be dealing with somebody that has no real substance you know it's like there's no more there's no more attraction there's this is like an unrequited love one side unre i'm no longer in love i'm no longer in love i'm no longer even though you once had the key to my heart you, you, the pain changed this woman because when you give birth, you change. So the pain changed this woman. It made her more beautiful than she was before, whoever this woman did. And now she's no longer, whoever the woman is, she's no longer, she no longer sees it as a viable opportunity. So I don't think it will be accepted. So if you are the female watching this, be prepared to you to receive some sort of message, text, uh, Facebook message, Instagram, whatever it is from somebody who wants you to give them another chance. But I think it will be quickly thwarted, you know what I mean? Quickly, whoo, halt, stop, done, no, uh-uh, nope, you know, that kind of thing. I think that... that uh, you know, and you maybe maybe it's maybe this needs to happen to get the closure that is needed. Doesn't look like it will ever lead to happily ever after. You know, there's a, there's a quote that I read about the past. I can't remember what it was, but when the past come back calls, when the past calls don't answer because they don't have anything new to say. It's true. So, it's true. So as far as I'm concerned here, and for as far as what I see, this connection is dead. But you may get the closure. You may get the closure that you need. So, is there a new opportunity for love in January? With somebody from the past, there is. Yes, there is. And a lot of you, you don't want to hear that. But maybe this is, this is, it is. If you look at, this is the last step. It's the last step that is needed. The world, because it's the step. It's funny, I'm pointing right at the foot. I didn't realize that until just now. It's the last step that is needed to before you get your reward. This closure is needed for the woman. It's the last step that is needed for this woman to get her reward. Now, there'll be some there'll be some jealous because there's jealousy here. There'll be some jealous men that watch this that don't want this woman to get her reward. She can get the closer closure by going within. She doesn't really need the communication. So don't think you're going to hinder her success because you are not. You're not. This woman just wants to be happy and she's not going to let herself be controlled anymore. So, you know, I really feel as though there's an ending. Okay. It's over. Where's that? Ten. Ten of cups. Ten of pentacles. Ten of swords. Completion, completion, completion. It's over completion even though there's a lack of closure the closure is around the corner it's around the corner let me get you another card what are we going to use what are we going to use
I think I'll use one of these. So it looks as though somebody's given up the fight. I'm giving up the fight. I'm no longer interested. And I feel like somebody has been through some sort of awakening. They've dealt with the pain in the past, doesn't want to let them go. They're jealous of who this person has become and they're going to get shut down. Empathy. <laughs> oh, oh, God. I am open to seeing both sides of a situation. Now, this is, this is what you're being called to do. And perhaps maybe this other person, that's what's happened. Now they're seeing, the, they're seeing it from both sides. They're no longer stuck. They've been enlightened. While they were stuck, though, this woman, she was delivering her pain. She's no longer in pain. She's healed. So this is an issue. It definitely is. So I feel like somebody wants a, wants, it has a genuine offer of love. And it will probably be turned down because it's, it's too late. It's over. Completion, completion, completion. It's over. The love has died. So is there a new opportunity for love with somebody from the past? Yes. Is there somebody new here? I don't see it. Because closure is still needed. It is. With that world card reverse, there's a lack of closure here. Something is incomplete. Could this work out? God, could it work out? You know, the overall outcome is right here. This is the, the la this is the overall outcome. Could this work out with teamwork and compromise and cooperation? It, it, you know, anything could work out. It could work out. It could work out. Communication, cooperation, compromise, and teamwork. That's the meaning of this card. Communication, compromise, cooperation, and teamwork. That's the only way it could work out. I accept that challenges are the best way to learn. And, 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 and this is a challenge. This is a challenge as well. So, hey, it's up to you. You're going to be presented with some sort of communication with somebody from the past. If you are the female, if you are the female watching this. Good luck.